potentially even Saturday getting into the 80s to the 60s for Monday and Tuesday. All right, Jason, thank you so much. Working together to stamp out hunger. Next month, letter carriers across the tri-state will collect canned goods for the Free Store Food Bank. Joining us now to talk a little bit about the event are Sarah Cook and Dave Kennedy. Thank you both for joining us. Thanks for having us. We appreciate it. Wonderful. And so let's talk a little bit about hunger, first of all, because I don't know that people really know how much of an issue this is. We're talking like one in six people here. Yeah, absolutely. One in this. six of our numbers or our neighbors right here in the tri-state are at risk of hunger. The Free Store Food Bank, we serve a 20 county span in Ohio, Kentucky, and Indiana. And if you break down the numbers, that's more than 290,000 people. Wow. And that's also over 94,000 children. So it's really prevalent right here in our own backyards. And we're working every day to try to address the need. Right. So if you know 10 people, six of them could be struggling, Correct. you know, with hunger. So talk about about what it is that you all are doing with this event. Well, this is the, uh, actually this is our 25th year and the reason this time of year is, was chosen is um, a lot of the school programs, school will be ending, so the programs will be will be ending, so that the greatest need is going to be going into the summer months. The supplies at the, the, the free store are getting low. A lot of people want to contribute around the holidays. So this, this is, uh, like I said, 25 years. Uh, it's, it's the simplest thing. Just before your uh, mail delivery on May 13th, uh, just set out a sturdy bag full of items just like this and your letter carrier will take care of the rest. This is a great idea for busy professionals, senior citizens that maybe can't get out, but they want to do something to help. You don't even have to leave your house. It's really it. an easy way to give back. And in fact, this is the largest food drive to support our efforts at the Free Store Food Bank. Last year's donations were the equivalent of more than 81,000 meals. Wow. And this food drive actually takes place nationally. We, the Free Store, just benefit locally as well as some of our partner food pantries, soup kitchens, shelters, that sort of thing. Um, and nationally, since the program began 25 years ago, more than 1.5 billion pounds wow. of food have been collected nationally. So That's it's amazing. really a, a, a big support to food banks across the nation. So for people that want to participate in this, you have some items here that kind of give us an idea of what you can leave outside your doorstep and what you should. Tell yeah. us a little bit about some of the rules. Anything that you would uh, put on your table for your own family. We typically like to take non-perishable food items. That's a little easier for us to distribute to the family that we serve, whether it be your canned fruits, canned veggies, pastas, canned meats, tuna, cereals, that sort of thing. And Dave might have a few pointers. It, they, they sometimes say that as their day progresses, typically their bags usually get a little lighter. And this is the one time of year that their bags get a little bit heavier. Yes. But maybe if you have <laughs> lighter so. items as their bags get heavier, I'm sure they appreciate that as but well. Yes, letter carriers, uh, <laughs> this, is, uh, this is a day in, in, in a lot of ways we look forward to, believe it or All not, right. because we are in every community six days a week. And, and a lot of times we see this firsthand as well. Yeah, you're so. really up close and personal mm -hmm. with some of these stories. Well, thank you both so much for joining thank us you. today. We Thanks really appreciate it. And this is certainly uh, something that's going to help a lot of people, a lot of families here in the tri-state to fight hunger. Absolutely. So thank you so much for thank joining you. us. Well, let's take a live look outside right now from your nine sky cam. A uh, little cloudy out there, but we have some storms rolling through the area later on tonight. Jason Adams is timing it all out for us.